Every car owner knows the importance of being properly geared up. No matter the season, changing your tyres is no cakewalk. It requires a deft touch and meticulous attention to detail to keep you safe on the road. 1. Before you start, do this. Park the vehicle on a flat surface. Apply the handbrake and put the gear lever in park if the vehicle is automatic, or put it in gear if the vehicle is manual. Make sure nobody's inside the vehicle. Place stop locks on either side of the wheel and position them diagonally from the tyre to be changed. 2. Remove the hubcap or wheel cover if present. 3. Loosen the wheel nuts half a turn. It is a good idea to use a special wheel nut socket that has a protective plastic sleeve to avoid scratching the rim and the sides are thinner so you can access the bolt in the rim. If you do not have access to an impact wrench, it is an advantage to use a breaker bar handle so you get a lot of torque. Do not use a torque wrench for this task. You will destroy it. 4. Lift the car. Place a jack under the car. If you are unsure where to place the jack, you can find information in the car's owner's manual. Lift the car until the tyre is about 15 cm from the ground. Place a sturdy and approved jack stand under the car. 5. Remove the wheel nuts. Take care of the nuts so that the threads do not get dirty. Clean them. 6. Remove the tyre. Mark the position of the tyre, left front, right front, and so on. Good to do if you need to rotate the tyres the next time you put them back on. Brush the hub from rust and dirt. 7. Replace the tyre. If the tyres are marked as above, roll each tyre to the correct wheel hub and lift them into place. If they are not marked, check whether the tyre has a specified direction of rotation. 8. Tighten the wheel nuts. Only do this by hand first. Tighten the nuts crosswise. 9. Lower the car. Tighten the wheel nuts with a torque wrench to avoid damage to the rim and nuts. The correct torque can be found in the car's owner's manual. 10. Replace the hubcap or wheel cover. 11. Check the air pressure. 12. Retighten the bolts after 10 miles. And that's all there is to it. For recommendations on what tools to use, please visit tengtools.com.